Zheng uh, Ming He, I hope I, I hope I got it close, and then uh, Jennifer Yang. Go, go. go ahead. Good to see you. Okay. Thanks for coming down. All right. Um, ever since the Chinese Culture um, Center opened, it has become a really popular attraction in the Phoenix metropolitan area. You think it's only for Chinese? Well, not quite. People of all minor er, nationalities, including Americans, Europeans, and African Americans, visit the center and made it one of their beloved locations to visit in Phoenix. Um, everyone has their own experiences to share, and of course, I have mine. On February 10, 2017, the Chinese class at um, Basha AMS, which stands for Salary Middle School, and Basha High School rode on buses toward the Chinese Culture Center as their field trip. I was one of them, a seventh grader at the time. Uh, when we arrived there, we skipped toward the ranch market with Joy. Inside the store, we bought bags of candies, drinks, and lunch. We visited the garden after we filled fill ourselves up with goodies from s the stores and restaurants. I was amazed at the wonderful uh, structures there in the garden. Um, I, if I were to use one word to describe the garden, it would be incredible. All the little details were handmade and, and imported from China. That's a lot of word I doubt you could duplicate your garden, even if you try your hardest. On our way back, uh, we showed off our souvenirs and were laughing, talking, and playing with each other with happiness. But it's not just happiness. It's happiness with such a great force that no one can break apart. Even as we walk, um, our walked off the bus and went our own separate ways home. I could see the smiles on my classmates' faces and just warms me up. Even though the Chinese Cultural Center is in a commercial zone, it provides a place for educational field trips for students of all ages and can teach them valuable lessons about um, of the culture. It's a great experience for students to try on new things, see the world, and empower them to pass on the Chinese culture, cultures to their kids in the future and to other people. The center is a place for social interaction and for people of all cultures to get together and explore all the things that the Chinese culture has to offer. The center is not just a store or a neighborhood Chinese restaurant or the garden in your backyard. It's the history of Arizona and the Chinese culture. If you can't um, deconstruct a Chinatown, then you cannot deconstruct the center. Today, I exhort you decision makers to stop the deconstruction of the Chinese culture center before it's too late. We as Basha High School and AMS students would like to come back and visit the Chinese culture center for this year's um, field trip. Not your everyday uh, headquarter office you see almost everywhere in downtown Phoenix. Here's my question for everyone. Do you really think an office building is worth more than the only uh, Chinatown in Phoenix? Thank you. Thank you very much, young man. Oh. Do we have your name just for the record? And um, also, this is a picture of the entire um, Basha High School and AMS <laughs> students. There's roughly about 100 of them, Thank I'd you. say. And today I had received about roughly about 30 signatures from my class. And they are all supporting, um, not supporting, the and deconstruction of the China. So you can state your name for the record, and then our clerk will get the uh, petition uh, from your classmates. What's your name? Um, What's your um, name? Jack. Uh, Jack Amal. Good to see you. Thank you for your testimony. Excellent. Welcome.